vicious. Ellie wants to see She's what we vicious. bought. She's so smelly. Yay. Hey guys, I'm Alexandra. Welcome back to my channel. I am joined by a very special guest, my friend Elle Linquist, who you may remember from a video I did a while back. I redecorated her loft space. And now I'm back again with a very exciting video. Do you want to tell everyone what it is? We went to Target today and I <laughs> vlogged the Target trips. If you want like the BTS behind the scenes, check out my channel because I vlogged everything. But today we're going to be showing the haul. Let me just say, I'm super excited to be on your channel because I think I might be your number one fan. So yeah, I'm so Except excited. You say that, but like I totally embarrassed myself maybe five months ago when I fangirls you hard and showed up at your house and was like, oh, I watch your vlogs all the time. No, not even. This is your house in real life. <laughs> we we maybe should have had more adult supervision during today's shopping yeah, haul. I agree. I agree. It also, was like the giddy leading the giddy. We're like, get that, get that, get that. And then there was like moments where I just turned around and Elle would just be in like the aisles like holding something and she was just like, I just like didn't know what to do with herself. She's like, it's too much to handle. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> the first thing is kind of funny because it's girl stuff and I have two boys. I have a four and a half year old and a two and a half year old and this is definitely for girls but I feel like I felt like the um, overalls are like androgynous so enough and they've cute. got these cute little foxes on them um, and so I just won't pair this shirt with Cohen stuff but I feel like he can wear the overalls with just like a white tee underneath so or something and like a little cardigan in the fall. So I would wear this. Yeah, like, please make this an, if they had an L, even with the crotch snaps. Yes, I'm I'm into it. I'm very into it. <laughs> Yay! Okay, um, this is a pom pom garland. So I mean, everyone knows that. Of course, I would buy this. Super cute. I'm gonna. Hang I love up, the wooden bead detail right? too. It's like mostly wooden beads strung with a few pom poms. I'm gonna put this along my mantle and I just refinished my mantle. It's this black tile. So I feel like this is going to pop. There you go. We also so discovered cute. that Opal House, like basically yes. we want everything they make. Yes. And I told you about, you know, Emily Henderson. Yeah. She's like all about the Opal House. So seeing it in real life is very exciting. Mm -hmm. Very exciting. Okay. This feels next... like Christmas morning. Yeah. <laughs> like what I got for Christmas. Yeah. Off. <laughs> um, okay. This next one is totally because of Alexandra. So I was saying like we needed new fitting fitted sheets. But in my bedroom, there's bunting of a bunch of different colors, mm -hmm. which is sentimental. It was behind our head table mm -hmm. when we got married. Um, so I didn't want to take it down, but it's hard to match. So we ended up getting this one, which is just kind of like little Scandinavian print. It's like so two cute. little lines and a dot. They had it in a coral color or this like mustardy gold. And so we went for this. Um, and it's just super soft. It's 100 because it's cotton. still like neutral, but it has that pop of pattern. A little bit boho, a little bit Scandinavian. Yeah. Um, Love it. Yeah. Also Opal House. Okay, this might be, I found this really last minute. I just am obsessed. Anything with like these cute little crosses and they're pink. I don't actually know where I'm gonna put this in my house, but it's a little accent rug. It was like $8, You'll find it was $10. I mean, like, come on. $10. Come on. Yeah, love it. Um, okay, we both, this is a twinsy. This is our first twinsy item. We both got these. They had them in a bunch of different prints. Uh, but it's just like a stoneware bake set. So there's like a square one and then a bigger rectangular one. So nice. I don't remember how much these were, but they were not expensive. 20, I think they were like $20. Yeah, something like that. And the print is just like, kind of like your grandma -ish, I love it. But 70s, I don't know, I loved it. Um, also, people who are watching this video and who know me know that I don't really cook all that often. So might be a weird purchase, but I was thinking like things like this just on display are so nice. And maybe this pretend. is just the inspiration you needed. Okay. Like right. now that you just didn't like, have I the want proper bakeware. <laughs> and now that you have the proper bakeware, <laughs> yeah. you're going to be amazed at how inspired you are to cook now. Amazing. Um, so I also got a couple clothing bits. I'm all about like the bows and the ruffles, just super cute. This, I tried it on, it's very low cut, but I'm gonna wear a tank top underneath it, so I'm gonna like layer it. Even like a bandeau. Right? Cute. And then this, look at these big, huge bows. They don't look ridiculous, like on, they look fine actually, and then buttons down the back. I'm interested to see how you style that. You need to do an Instagram post because I feel like that's the type of thing where I look at it like on the rack. Yeah. And I'm like, that's super cute, but yeah. like on my rack, I wouldn't know how. Right. To style it so you need to do an instagram okay. post styling that because i like it but i wouldn't know how to style it so I cute i love it so and just like super nice and airy for the summer did you get this too yes but okay, i think so, i got one i think you got oh two. i got two yeah so in total we got three 
of these little like book ends. So I have a lot of vinyl records and right now they're just being held up by a whole bunch of random stuff. So I thought this would look really cute and so more nice. stylized and it's got like a good weight to it. It's like but it's narrow too. Yeah. And so a lot of times you see with bookends, they're like huge, yeah. but then it takes up a lot of space. So I was going to go for the unicorn gold ones. Kind of glad I went for like the more modern, sleek, yeah. grown up yeah. option. <laughs> oh my gosh. Another rug. Ugh. Again, last minute purchase. But, but this like, is the thing. Like, okay, yeah. that at anthropology would be like 60 to $80. I think maybe this was like 20 more. And it was, yeah. So cute. I love all the colors. Something as simple like this in your kitchen can totally transform it mm -hmm. and just make it feel a lot much more special. I have a lug purse and it's like, it's so not cute, but it's so dang practical. Like everything fits in it. My <laughs> vlog camera fits in it. I'm a sucker for compartments. Like I love things with compartments. <laughs> and so it's just so functional that I wear yeah. it all the time, but like, it's really not cute. So I was like, if I could find a cute version. So I love that this is still that. like vegan, right? Cause it's fake leather, but it's got three different compartments. So it can be like one for kids stuff. Cause I've got two boys and it's just, yeah. This middle one is just like one big pocket. Like they'd really be nailing it out of the park if there was like like a inner, like a couple more Maybe there is. No, Maybe I there is. <laughs> oh, of course you did. Uh, of course you did. But yeah, I love the gold <laughs> hardware and yeah, I think it like, it's I don't really know, it was, cute. how much? 30 bucks. I feel like this could easily look like something you'd see at like Madewell or- I love it. Yeah. I love it so much. Cutest candle ever. The pom-pom top, like how adorable. For $5. $5. I love it, I love it. I love this color too, it reminds me of fall. Mm -hmm. So nice for fall. Um, okay, so I went a little yes. This was the best purchase of the day, hands down. Okay, so at Anthropology West Elm, they have this kind of style. It's like very Scandinavian, yeah. um, like even Dutch kind of looking. Uh, handmade. Handmade clay, but they were, okay, this one was $4.99. Some of the other bowls were $3.99 each. So I got, yeah, these cereal bowls. So there's like little tiny like ice cream bowls or so treat cute. bowls. And it's all still like dishwasher safe, microwave safe. Um, Cause that was the other thing I was, I was like, is this the catch? They're $3.99, but you have to hand wash them. Ain't nobody got time for hand washing. No. Um, <laughs> these are the side plates. Yeah, those are gorgeous. Golly! The style is like so in right now too, that like flat but then raised sides. Yeah, yeah I love it. Bigger version so of gorgeous. the side plate. And they also had it in black as yeah. well. And this was by the, what, this was the Hearth, Hearth and Hand. Hearth and Hand, the, with Magnolia collection. Such beautiful stuff. It's kind of a random purchase, but it's a paper towel holder because I was telling Elle, we just like shove our paper towel under the cabinet. It has no place. And I just thought this was so beautiful for on our counter. I love the gold. It was like $5 or something ridiculous. Like I love it. And it's like hefty. Like it's like Yeah, sturdy. and I like that it's minimal too. Like there's yeah. lots of like, not tons of fiddly bits. Yeah, I love it. Um, This is gorgeous. That yes. Nice. Okay. This is this amazing bath mat. Look, look at the tassels. I like, love it. So I love friend. it. So boho. I'm actually doing a small bathroom makeover that's coming to my channel soon, so I might actually use this in the makeover, um, or I might just keep it for myself. I haven't decided, but I love it. And it's a good size too, like it's, mm -hmm. it's big. Mm -hmm. You could even use that for like, um, in a kitchen, like by your sink. I totally, it's big enough that you could do that. I, I agree. And it's like the carpety material, it's not, yeah. but it, it looks like that carpety material. Yeah. I love it. Love it. The colors. Um, Did you get one of these? No, because oh. I, I had nowhere to put it. Oh, yeah. I was going to, but then I there was no room to put it. So this, we both got one of these. Yes. Although you got the different smell, right? No, we got we went back for the same. Oh yeah, no, yeah, I did. No, you I got did. desert flora. Yeah. And I got the amber a vetiver one. and amber or something like that. Like so gorgeous for a mantle. Okay, so here's we both got these pictures. Yes. When I was in North Carolina a couple months ago. And I saw this at Target while I was there and I was like, how do I get this on my carry-on to bring home? But it just wasn't, it was gonna break, <laughs> it was heavy, not feasible. But I was like, I need to find that picture. So There's I'm so, two left. Yeah, meant to be. So cute for your table or like putting flowers in as a vase. Oh my gosh. I love it so much. Yay, oh yeah, this is adorable. Literally don't know where I'm gonna put it, but the cutest little table light, just such a nice little accent piece. Again, it was like, I don't even know, like 20 bucks, like amazing. And I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but there's like, 
like blues, purples, greens, the little flecks in it. So that could go with any totally. decor color. It almost looks like concrete. It's not, but it's like that concrete style. Yeah, I love it with all yeah. the different colors. And I feel like the bulb is gonna be really warm. Mm -hmm. Like one of those vintage styles. Like the Edison style. Yes. Yeah. Love it. Uh, okay, I got a little cardigan. So I have one that's like almost identical to this, but it was from Forever 21 and it's like five years old. So it's all pilly and like just, it needed to be replaced. So, and if you follow me at all, I live in leggings, an oversized t-shirt, and a cardigan. Your style, Elle's style is just like goals. Like follow her on Instagram just to see her outfits. My daily goal is to feel like pajamas while still but looking chic. But you always look so put together. But I'm also like, and you I look ain't. so comfortable. Oh yeah, <laughs> if I will never, I will always choose comfort yeah. over anything, so. But you make it look so good. Kind of a random purchase, but it's one of those huge jumbo balloons, like massive. It has glitter inside it and these tassels that go down. It was like $2. And I find like these are really expensive at those paper, independent paper stores. And I just thought it'd be cute for an Instagram. Mm -hmm. I've actually always wanted to hold a balloon in an Instagram, so that's my chance. I, just have, I need something to celebrate. Subscribe, so I have something to celebrate. I think when you hit 5,000 subscribers, that's should when do you it. should do the okay. balloon thing. <laughs> Um, okay, this is a, I love this. Oh, this so, is so you. $7. Amazing. It looks like Carrera marble. I love it. And the smell of sandalwood. And it's, I didn't know it was a lilac inside. That is so pretty. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is so you. Like that's gonna work so well in your I living room. Okay, these are really cute. Salt and pepper shaker. We actually don't have matching at home. $3 each. Come like, on. Cutest little decor pieces for our kitchen table. This I saw and right away was yes. like, yep, going, I'm gonna yes. put it on that wall. Yes. That's such a good idea. Um, in my kitchen. So, I'm so excited. It's like about the this. old school brown paper and you just like write little notes. So maybe I'll feel like super Instagram y and like do inspirational messages. Sometimes it'll be like pick up more soy milk. Love it. Or whatever. But you just like tear it down um, to get more paper. It's actually so great for grocery lists if yeah. it's in the kitchen yeah, or like yeah. writing notes to Dan or whatever. Mm -hmm. Like I love it. And I was telling Al, these are so expensive online because not a lot of people are making them right now. I love it. I love it. And yeah, 20 bucks. <laughs> um, okay, this is kind of a funny purchase as well, but it's because you're so inspired by your bakeware. So basically I'm gonna go home. I'm going to write up all these recipes on these like adorable little recipe cards and then I'm gonna cook them in my new bakeware. Um, but they have little florals around the edges and then you write the recipe and then if I'm feeling really, I don't know, like the next best chef of, I don't know, Toronto, um, I can get a recipe box and there's like these dividers. So it says bread, breakfast, sides, and appetizers. Um, these are $4.99. I was also thinking like I could just give them as a gift. Like but I'm like, so that at Anthro, so that, like, that's so Anthro. Totally. And that would be 18, 28, 25, something like that. 25 probably. Yeah. Yeah. Love them. Okay, this next one is for my older, my oldest son Yay, Ford, so who's cute. dinosaur obsessed. So he currently has an owl light. It looks exactly like this, but it's an owl, and it lights up, and that's how we read him his bedtime stories. So he's going to be so stoked to Love see it. that he has a dinosaur light now, and I'll move the owl light to Coco's room. So so cute. Is it? Am I a bad mom that I only got something for Ford and nothing for Cullen? I mean, he's two. He doesn't know. He wanted the difference. <laughs> Mom of the year. <laughs> oh yeah, this was fun. Okay, so we went to two, I don't know if we said this right, but we went to two Targets um, and I found this last minute, but this is so cool. It's an LED pendant light, $8 and it's battery operated and I got it for a future video. Like you just hang it anywhere. You don't need an outlet and it looks so beautiful and it has this floral pattern on the bulb. They had some too where the, the actual light bulb looked like floral pattern and stuff. Yeah. So beautiful. It's like nifty, great for a dorm room as well. Oh, this is my version of your candle. So yeah, amber and vetiver. So nice. And once the candles all burn, like you could, I was you could plant. Totally thinking about flowers, that. plant pot. Um, cute little stickers. These were like a dollar something. Little heart stickers. I love stationery like this to put on the back of envelopes or just like just anything. Unless they're sucker for stationery. Me too. I actually, unlike the bakeware, like I actually use my stationery. Oh okay. yeah, I like handwrite cards and yeah, stuff. Same. Yeah. Okay, this was not sexy, but super like, like I'll use this all the time. I saw that and I was like, that's genius. And I've never seen it in no. any like kitchen store. So it's just like a bottle cleaner, but I carry like a big bottle of water around me wherever I go. Yeah. And so it's BPA and lead free, and it's just got like little different types that. of nubbies. So it's for cleaning like deep 
water bottles. Also, I use mason jars for smoothies all the time, and they're so difficult to clean. Because your hand doesn't yeah. quite, it's like the pickle exactly. cloth. Yeah, I love that. so, cool. Good. Um, I got this big mug. I am a sucker for like a big, I drink a lot of tea. Um, I just, I thought this was so nice for the winter. It's just like nice and special. I also, this is like totally meaningless, but I love mugs that curve in at the top a little bit. Yeah. I don't know why, it just, it's fun to drink from mugs that are, sh those are my favorite shaped mugs. And there's nothing worse than like a mug with the handle that's too small, mm -hmm. but this is perfect. It's just like a good size one. We also like, saw like feel good in the hand. Jumbo mugs. Oh yeah, like, like Huge. gallons. So these I actually got for the bathroom makeover I'm doing. These beautiful Project 62, I've heard of Project 62 before. Um, I think it's Target exclusive. I think it is too. Brushed brass finish knobs, like how gorgeous. These actually look like Elle's schoolhouse knobs that she has in her kitchen. Um, I just think they're so sophisticated, so beautiful. They were like $5 a pack or something. Yeah, I got um, the gold ones to hang Ellie's leash by my front door. Like something, again, something as simple like this on your kitchen cabinets or your entry or whatever, it can just totally change the look and feel of your, mm -hmm. of your space. Yeah, I'm actually really obsessed with these. Flamingo washi tape. Did I need yes. it? No. Did I want it? Yes. We had a conversation in the store. I was like, washi tape is actually something. No, so I to use on a I've gone basis. through at least eight rolls this yeah. year. Like I, I genuinely use my washi tape yeah. all the time. But love it. Two dollars. So I'm always taking Those notes ones. when I'm like in meetings with clients or whatever. So, and I really liked that this notebook lays flat. So I'm not a lefty. I write with my right hand, but I write like a lefty. Like I write yeah. on top of my, so I always have the same issues that all lefties have of like pen smudging and like spiral note. I can't do it um, because my hand just gets in the way. <laughs> so I like that it's not spiraled and I like that it lays totally flat and love I just it. love that pattern. We had a I'm whole... not super hot on the like write it down thing. Yeah, it's like did that, is it though? I think it's kind of cute. <laughs> just remind me like write it down in this notebook. Okay. Write it down. I don't I, I don't <laughs> hate it. Elle and I had maybe a, like a 45 minute conversation on the way home about organization. We were like talking about like color coding things, like what calendars we use. Like, I was I like, this is a it. good chat. <laughs> so this was a big purchase at $2.50, but you got the real sale. I got a sweet deal at 77 cents. And I was like, you can't go wrong. And like you, I just write everything down, especially when I'm on calls or something. And I'm always like, where's my notebook? So mm -hmm. this will be my dedicated notebook. I like it. This was just like a silly little thing. So but cute. I have one that's similar to this that we styled in the home print yeah. um, in my loft that has like a flower on it, but it's it's similar. So it's $8, I love it. which is maybe a little bit high for like a felt cactus I thing. I think it's so but cute though. I'm thinking I can style this in the big bookshelf in the playroom or something. I love it. I just thought it was cute. Can't go wrong. Both got twinsy calendars. So we're planning on using this for our YouTube content. Yes. So just like planning out our content for the month. And I like that it can fit on the desk. And I like or twinsies. hang on the wall. Yeah, you, it's and like I just like to hang on the wall. Live for this print. I feel like anyone that follows me will know that this is just my jam. Yeah. But I saw this and I was like, I need, I need this. This I got to sit. Didn't you, oh. did you get the small version? No, no, I am obsessed with this. Yeah, it's I. So you. So it definitely doesn't go with my kitchen currently, but we're redoing my kitchen in a couple weeks. So I can't wait September. for those videos. So I'm planning on putting protein powder in here. I, I was saying it. like, I am not the mom that can keep cookies in a cookie jar <laughs> on my counter because this would be gone by the end of the day. Like if it's in my eyesight, yeah. I'm eating it. So yeah. unfortunately for my kids, I cannot be the mom that has like cookies constantly on the counter, but I can put my protein powder in it. So I think that's such a good hack too. Like if you have those things that you use every day that would make sense to be kept on your counter, just get like a decorative jar like this. I think it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. And this will be, cause the kitchen's gonna be like mostly all white. So yeah. this will be just like a bit of a statement. I love it so much. That was like 20 bucks too. Like something yeah. ridiculous. Maybe even less. Yeah, $19.99. I got this, which I think is supposed to be a laundry basket, right? Love it. You can use it for anything. But I'm planning on putting Ziggy, my Monstera. His name's Ziggy? Yeah. Or her? Hey, him. Yeah. Him. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> in... Which has grown like infinitely since I've last been here. It's very happy. No, that's not Ziggy. Ziggy's my curly one because it looks like dreadlocks. Oh. Sorry, that's Sven. Sven. Um, so Sven <laughs> is planning on going in here. So he normally sits in that corner over there. Um, and so I just like the idea of instead of just like a regular planter, yeah. just making it a little, what's that, how do you pronounce it? Higgy, Higgy? It's Huga. Okay, so I was close, sorry. You're way off. <laughs> Took me a while. Yeah, it's Huga. 
And it's, I mean, don't get me started on hookah. I could, talk to, I could talk to you about it for like an hour. But this is, is this not totally hookah? It's very hookah. It's like cozy hookah textile. Hookah is all about like, well, you should do a video on I hookah. Feel, you know what? Actually, let me know in the comments below if you know what hookah is, and if not, if you'd want a video on it. And we're or not you saying do. hookah like the pipe. No, it's hookah. It's, it's a, a Danish design. word for like, Coziness, like warmth, friendship, it's all the things basically. But yeah, that's very hookah. Is this everything? Except you're forgetting oh, the yeah. most important. Okay, so I don't know if it's in the frame or not, but I have a sofa and I wasn't like in love with the pillows. My husband Dan is probably gonna kill me because I I buy house pillows like some people I buy even toilet said paper. To you, I was like, oh you have a lot of throw pillows already. But I do I not <laughs> use them all? No, you do. I use all you of do. them. You do. So and I just wasn't like with because we redid our living room. We had a flood back in the fall. So we redid our living room and I just I wasn't loving the throw cushions with the new yeah. vibe. And so I was like, I just feel like I want more textile sort of stuff. Yeah. So we, we got three. Can I just say, sorry, before you talk about the pillows, if you guys haven't seen Elle's vlog about the flood, I mean not to be a downer, but like that was a stressful video to watch. If you're if you're up for some drama today, I'll link it down below. You want you some tea? Go, <laughs> go check it out. But you transformed this living room. Mm -hmm. It's so beautiful. Mm -hmm. It's very minimal. And I feel like these cushions will totally just add that pop. Because right now there's not like, there's not a pop of color. And mm -hmm. that's what you need. I think that's what you need. Yeah, and my style is sort of like a mix of Scandinavian, <laughs> mid-century modern, and a little bit of boho. It's I love like it. It's like a hybrid of all of them. Yeah. Which I feel like all of yeah. these do. And so, so we literally like went to an aisle in Target, laid out all the cushions that we found, and we- Anything we liked, we put in the yeah. cart, and then we like played around with them. Yeah. We found like a corner and played but around with them. But these are like, I think they're so gorgeous. Mm -hmm. This is like something you'd find in Morocco. Totally Moroccan inspired. Ellie, do not punch our guest. Ellie, she likes it. And then our last so one. So much texture. Oh shoot. Our last one is this one. So yeah. And the pop of color. I think this is like way more. And I this is it. hookah too. Very hookah. Yeah. Very hookah. Tell them the story about the rug. Cause this is like a buy and return and then buy the situation. Rug, the rug found me. Yeah, it did. What, so in the we, second target. We saw a rug that we both just about died over. It was gorgeous. And um, we both were like, we're buying this rug. Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. I was like, I don't know where I'm gonna put it. We're like, we'll find a place. Yeah. And it's not a small rug. It's like a five by seven foot rug. Like it's not a little I'm rug. Glad, I'm you're... kind of glad I didn't buy mine because Andrew would have been like, he, he would have just been like, what, where are we gonna put this rug? <laughs> like he, no. <laughs> so I bought it because I was like, well, I'll put it in the playroom for the boys. Cause right now the one we have, it's just like one from Walmart and it's too small. So um, I bought it, felt good about it, but then when we went to the second Target, because yeah. we're that level of crazy, yeah. I saw this one and I was like, <gasps> like yeah. my heart fluttered. It's so gorgeous. And it's like the, the Con Marie, the life-changing magic, like what brings you joy. Yeah. I loved that carpet. Yeah. I died over it when we first saw it, but when I saw this one, I was like, this makes my heart sing. This is more me. I love it so much. So much texture. Again, like very Moroccan inspired. Mm -hmm. Is that it, Elle? That's it. Feels like a shebang. Oh, it was such a good day. I <laughs> genuinely had, it was like the pinnacle girls day. It was so like fun. Her, and so it's like a two hour drive, two yeah. and a half hour. We trucked the entire way there yeah. and the entire way back about yeah. like life and work and like, yeah. But also I've said this to you so many times, but you're one of those people who I don't know, from the moment I started watching your vlogs, I'm just like, I get you, we connect. And we've missed we've missed each other so many times in the last like year and a half. And I would message you on Instagram as like a fan being like, oh, you were at that event. Like I was invited to that event, but I didn't go. And it was like, she's gonna think I'm so weird. No, well, and, but when you came to shoot the home print, yeah. you know those people, like there's just certain people where right away when you meet them, you yeah. just click. It's yeah. like your vibe is the same and you're like, mm -hmm, you're my type of people. Same <laughs> thing, within like three minutes, I was like, oh, we're friends. Yeah. That's I also think it's kind of like a big deal to go to the States, cross the border with someone you've only met like once. once? <laughs> so basically, we're the best and this was the best We're day. now kindred spirits. Yes, <laughs> we went to Target. Um, well guys, go give Elle a follow, watch her vlogs. You post three times a week. Mm -hmm. Elle's vlogs are very like family oriented, super cute, but also you do these amazing clean with me organized videos, which are so satisfying to yeah, watch. Yeah, most of my channel's vlogs, but I do love the clean with me and organizing videos. And you're good at it. Yes. 
Okay, thanks so much for watching, guys. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Let us know in the comments what haul we should do together next, mm -hmm. what shop we should shop. And what you think from our our bounty. Yes. Uh, what do you think is like the best deal that we got? What do thing? you think is the best deal out of yours? Gosh, that's hard. It might be that rug. rug. Yep. Or... Or no, it's it's, it's the, the dishware it's set. The dishware. It's the dishware. Yeah, that such that was such a good find. For me, I feel like for me it was. Well, like I got a bunch of small things. I feel like that the pom pom rug. The pom pom rug, and I really like the cross rug. Mm -hmm. Just like all the things, the bath. Just mat. like everything. Just I like got. everything I got is great. <laughs> okay, thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you next Friday. Bye. Yay, Allie! You did it. <laughs> <laughs>